Hey guys, so let's try some hard arms on the reformer using the Pilates arc. So you want to take off the straps and then you want to put the arc on kind of in the center. So you just put it over the shoulder blocks. I have us on one red spring, but you could gauge it and see what you feel like you should be on. All right, so we're going to sit on the arc. And the arc kind of helps you with your C-curve for the abs. So you can do the inside straps. I'm going to go the inside straps. If it's too heavy, long straps. I'm on one rest spring. Your legs are just over the hump of the arc. And we'll do biceps from here. And you want to keep the abs up. If you did want to challenge, you could lift the legs to tabletop or do straight legs out. So up to you. Let's just do eight of everything. So five more, four, three, two, last one. Rest, or you could go into the next one. So I'm going to open up like a reverse hug of the tree. Seven, six, five, four, three, two last one rest and in this position you definitely want to keep the abs in let's go into a rotate from here open rotate other side eight seven six five four three two last one resting okay so we'll do a little bit of shoulders from here so i'm gonna go to the long straps but it's up to you c curve knuckles up straight arms up down seven six five four three Two. last one resting and then let's do a little bit of chest opening so normally i would sit really tall on the arc and then you want to choke up on the straps unless it's too heavy over the inside or the outside sit really tall straight arms back so keep the shoulders relaxed still keep the abs in six five four three two last one and since we're sitting tall and we're choked up on the straps you can hinge forward and we'll try the triceps from here so bend in stretch out keep the abs in seven six if it's too heavy you could go to the inside straps five four three two last one resting there's so much that you could do on the arc i love it it's one of my favorite things i use it all the time with clients and yeah until next time we'll do more